Hi, my lovelies. Welcome to the Polka Palace. It is your girl, Pocahontas, and I am back with another tutorial. This is gem chalk and water. It is mostly Aider gem chalk, but I mixed in a whole box of Z Athletic because I think I crushed Z Athletic last week, a couple days ago. I'm not sure. I'm just mixing this in. I want to get it thick. Right now, it's a little runny, so I'm going to add in some more gem chalk and get it a little thicker. I want it like a mashed potato kind of consistency. I'm keeping it white, but I'm going to use some molds and put in some... Um, I'm going to put in some glitter and some dye. I bought these bunt cakes. They are super, super cute. I always see Pearly use them and my girl Calico and I love them. So I'm just putting in some pink and yellow and some green sparkles. It probably won't look like that when it's done. You know, colors, they tend to, to fade out and uh, glitter doesn't always do what it's supposed to. And that's my dog in the background. He's such an attention whore for messing up this video. Um, I've been getting so many molds in the mail lately, especially these right here. Someone sent me these. The person that sent me these sent me a lot of molds. I'm so appreciative. I could not track her down. I could not find her on Instagram. I don't know who she is, but in my mind, she is my angel. Thank you so much. If you need me to watch your kids, wash your car, walk your dog, I'm your girl because I'm so appreciative that you thought of me and sent me this. These are troubling times for me right now. But anyway, um, using more glitter and more dye and I'm just using the end of a piece of paper and just kind of giving those like a little swirl and I'm just going to top those off with some more glitter. I think that'll be kind of cute. This mold I bought myself, it's a unicorn horn kind of thing. I'm pouring in some glitter and then I'm going to pour in some purple and let that kind of stripe down so it gives it maybe like a stripe effect. Now, if you never see this reform, it's because it didn't come out of the mold. I don't even know how this will work. I'm going to try my best to get it out without breaking. See, it got a little nice swirl on it. I think it's going to be really cute. Um, I would hate to cut that mold cut the mold down the middle just to get the horn out but i don't know i don't know if it's gonna come you know out in one piece but we're gonna try our best with that and i'm gonna top that with some glitter the uh lady that sent me those red molds sent me these heart molds too i'm so appreciative i'm throwing in some pink and um red glitter and some pink dye and i'm just going to give it a swirl and a shimmy shake and i think it's going to come out very very pretty valentine's day is coming up soon you guys are all my valentines i love you so much and this is just a tutorial it's gym chalk and water you want it to be like a little mashed potato consistency thank you guys so much for coming to the polka palace where you will always be my treasures and I love you so much. Just giving this one little shake, one last little top over, and it's going in the dehydrator. Peace.